I'll go take a shower and I'll start crying there. That's where we cry. We cry in the shower like normal people. Good morning. Good morning. It's Saturday. It's so early. And when I mean so early, I mean early as in this is the time I would get up and get ready to go to school. So, six days in a row at this time is killing me. Also, this is my laundry that I need to put away. But I'm really lazy to do that. So, we don't. Yet. Yet. Jordan, why are you up so early on a Saturday? I'm gonna go play table tennis. <laughs> That's right, I'm gonna go play ping pong, table tennis, whatever you call it. In my city, junior high schools once a year have a little tournament, a little table tennis tournament, and I love going to it. It's a lot of fun. It's great. In my last year, I can do it, so I'm a little sad. Just a little sad. So I'm gonna go, and I'm gonna have a good time, and I'm gonna try to I'm gonna try to freaking win this time. I'm gonna try. I'm in the doubles. I don't know if I'm women's doubles or like mixed doubles yet, so we'll see. But I'm up early so I can catch a ride to morning practice, which is like a warm up. Gotta, you know, loosen up everything. And then we'll head over. I don't know how much I'll be able to video because it's a bunch of teachers and. Japanese people like their privacy, so I'll try to video some, like, general stuff, but I probably won't be able to, like, video me actually playing, because I really want to be focused and I really want to win. I know, this is supposed to be, like, a fun, hey, let's play table tennis with all the teachers, and I'm over here like, I want to win, I want to win, I want to win, but we're going to have a good time either way, so we'll see what we can do. And then I have a party tonight in Japan after you do an event or something. They have a party, a drinking party basically, and I'll do that tonight. I definitely won't be videoing there because then that's going to be all up close and personal and those are kind of moments for me. Moments for my memory, not to be shown to y'all, even though I love you guys. I hope I can video some more and I hope this can actually turn into a cool video for you guys. So I'll see you later. Japanese people don't sweat like they don't because I've just been practicing for like an hour and I've already got like a like a pit stain on my black shirt that you can see but these all of my teachers who have also been practicing nothing no nope, it's fine and I put on so much deodorant this morning fun fact Japanese people just don't sweat I'm like I'm I'm sure of this information just in case you were wondering. So we lost in the semifinals. And I'm not mad because we lost. I'm not, I'm not sad because we lost. I'm sad because it's my last time at the tournament and I'm trying not to cry. But now everyone's gonna think I'm upset because we lost and that's not it. It's just my last time here and I couldn't finish playing. If I don't stop talking, I'm gonna keep crying. So we're gonna try to compose ourselves in a way with makeup running down my face. Okay, we're back. 
It's only been about 30 minutes. I realized that I could have just done the vlog this way instead of videoing myself in the in the bathroom, but I didn't. I decided to do something weird and show my phone in the bathroom mirror. But we're here. Whatever. It's 30 minutes later. Emotions have died down. Still upset. Little, still a little upset, obviously. When you do something for the last time, it just kind of hits you, you know? I'm still upset, but I'm not crying, nor do I feel like crying. I'll go take a shower and I'll start crying there. That's where we cry. We cry in the shower like normal people. Don't do that, kids, guys. Don't do that. <laughs> yeah, we lost in the semifinals. And again, the whole time I was doing mixed doubles with an English teacher that I teach with, and that was really fun, but we kept losing. <laughs> because we always got the really hard people. We always got the really hard people, so we kept losing. They thought, the team, and I don't mind that they changed me, the team thought that if they changed the singles, the women's singles, to my doubles partner, they could win. Because all the doubles had been doing really, really good. And I'm not saying I was a weak, a weak link, but I was the weaker link. Therefore, they moved me to women's singles. And I was really scared at first because usually women's singles that far into the tournament is really, really good. But the lady I played, I think the same thing happened to her. I think they changed the partner somewhere as so she was doing women's singles. Because she was good, but she's not the typical women's singles. I was really close to the first point, and I lost because I think I was scared the first point. So the second point, I was like, okay, I'm getting it. I'm getting it. I'm getting to where she's at. I'm, I'm understanding her play. And then the men's doubles, the women's doubles, and the mixed doubles all lost. Therefore, even if I had won, and even if the men's singles had won, we as a school would have lost. And we were already running into overtime in the tournament as a whole, so they three points in to my second my second match they just stopped they stopped us because we had lost obviously i don't want to say i'm mad at my teammates i mean the other team is better they're gonna win that's fine but i do wish they would have let me finish my game i think that's what it, what it is at the end of the day i wish they would have let me finish my game and they didn't so that is what we are slightly upset about now we're going home. Uh, I need to eat food and I want sushi, but it's so far. Like it's past my apartment and I can't go to like nice sushi because I'm in like sweatpants. That's where we're at. I'm sorry. I didn't think you guys would see me cry like five videos into my life, but you did. So we've officially done this together. Cars. Car. Light. Green light. I totally forgot to say that despite us losing, obviously the winner is first, the loser of the finals is second, but there's two teams that play and would technically be third, and we kind of got, we got that. So we actually got some money, so we didn't do too bad. We got some money and we got a certificate, and we also got a really cool picture that I need to ask the teacher for because I want it. All in all, it was a great day and it was going to end either way. It could have ended way earlier, but I managed to play three different, against three different schools, three different games. So at the end of the day, I should be, I should be happy with what I got. Now I'm gonna start crying because I'm gonna be freaking sentimental. I think, I think this is the, sorry, I have to cry again. I think this is the beginning of me realizing that I'm leaving soon. I'm going to high school. And that's... It didn't hit me until now. Because I love my schools. I love the people here. Even if the people change every year. I've had some people who have stayed and been here and I'm lucky to have them. I'm hoping 
this is this isn't me being pessimistic against high school, but I'm not good with change. Let's just be totally honest. I am not a good person when it comes to change. I'm gonna wait for my bus and control my emotions. Or, or come to come to an understanding with them. Maybe I'll vlog a little bit later. I have a party tonight, but I'm not obviously not gonna vlog the party because we're gonna be drinking and stuff, so I shouldn't put that online. But me, I'll vlog on the way there. So, I'll see you guys later. So, I'm in the middle of editing the video about the table tennis tournament, and I realize I never really finished that, so there's no outro or anything. So we're gonna do a quick outro right now. Long story short, at the party, it was great. It's always great. I love teacher parties. It's probably like the best part about my job is going to the teacher parties after big events. Like I, you know, told everyone like, hey, this is my last table tennis tournament and like, thank you guys so much for like having me and for like having me be like a key member of the team, not just like cheering or like on the B or C team. They had me on the A team. I was actually playing a lot and they've done that for the past three years. They've always put me in a position where I get to play a lot and I'm so, 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 so thankful for them and so I had to do a little speech and I said that and everyone was like, what, you're leaving? No, 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 like you can't kind of thing. And that made me feel really, really good, especially after, after I had that whole moment, few moments of crying. After two teachers got really, really drunk, they were talking to me and they were like, it, no problem, of course, in Japanese, of course in Japanese, but they were like, no problem, no problem. We'll still put you on our team. We'll still, doesn't matter what school, we'll put you on our team so you can still play. And Again, we're all drunk. I, I took it with a grain of salt, but still, it made me feel really good after that, um, again, after that whole, like, situation emotionally. So, very, very thankful. Anyway, that's the end of that story. That's the end of that day. Thank you guys so much for watching and sticking with me this far. Do what you usually do. Like, comment, subscribe like you would for anyone. And I'll see you guys next time. Bye bye.